to today's video. I am doing a night routine for school 2017 and this video has been so highly requested so I thought I would do it and also I love filming and making routines for you guys. Also I don't know if you guys remember but in last week's video I announced that I have my own t-shirt line now with Formosa Labs which is so exciting. The shirts say Mini Lucy and there are four different colors on minilucy.com. I'm going to have all the links and everything you need down below and there was also some confusion because on the website it says it's all in Canadian dollars but there's actually a converter on the website now that converts it to US dollars and a bunch of other currencies so I thought that would be helpful for you guys to convert the pricing depending on where you live. I'm also going to be hosting a little competition for you guys which is super exciting so in the comments below I'd like you to comment one of your favorite texts or slogans that you would like to see on one of these t-shirts because we want to sell one that has one of your slogans on there so comment a slogan or your favorite text or something down below and whichever comment gets the most likes we will turn into a t-shirt that will be selling on minilucy.com so your slogan could be on one of these shirts so make sure to comment down below and like whichever one is your favorite and if your slogan or text wins on the shirt we will give you a free shirt so that's pretty awesome. Make sure to go buy some t-shirts down below and comment your favorite slogans. So I think that's all I have to say for this intro. Sorry if it was a little bit long. I just had some exciting announcements. And let's go ahead and get started. For my night routine, I usually get home around 5 o'clock p.m. after school or dance practice. And the first thing I do is say hi to my cat, Aisha, because I love her so much and I missed her at school. So then I am just walking inside my house. And let me just tell you, it feels so amazing to be home after a long day of school. Let me know if you agree. Next, I just headed up to my room upstairs and set my heavy backpack down and took off my shoes to get more comfortable. And I'm usually too lazy to change clothes. I just stay in the clothes I wore at school. And before I start my homework, I just like to take some time for myself and kind of check up on social media. Look at your Instagram posts. I love the people that post fan pictures. It seriously makes my day and you guys are so sweet. Like I never thought anyone would do this and I just love you all so much. So thank you for that. And I'll also catch up on some YouTube videos. But right here I'm looking at the skirt that I designed with Mo. There was a picture on Instagram of it which reminded me to tell you that it's only out for about two more weeks. So if you want to buy it, it's only $10 free shipping everywhere and it helps St. Jude Children's Hospital. So it's amazing. After relaxing for a bit, I grab my heavy backpack. It's seriously feels like a bag of bricks and unfortunately it's time to start my homework but before I start I like to use some essential oils I go onto Pinterest and search up some essential oil blends and there are tons on there I decided to make an energy blend because I needed some energy after a long day at school so I just filled up my diffuser that I got for Christmas with some water and put a few drops of peppermint and sweet orange in there turn that on and it seriously makes you feel so relaxed and more energized and I just think it makes a perfect environment for doing my homework you got me, you got me good. And after I procrastinated enough, unfortunately, it's time to hit the books. So right here, I was just doing some U.S. history homework, highlighting some important things in the textbook. And I don't always do that. I was just feeling productive that night. And then I will take out my notes, write some of those, outline some things, and I do my other homework as well from other subjects. Just pretty self-explanatory. And I'll also take this time during some breaks during my homework to plan out some videos, which is my favorite thing to do. I got out my planner and just wrote down some ideas and stuff like that so that I'm organized for later. And once I'm finished with my homework, my mom will usually call me down for dinner and we'll all eat together as a family. So tonight my mom made this delicious fish with sweet potatoes and green beans and it was so yummy and it really hit the spot. And after dinner, I don't know about you guys, but I have a sweet tooth and I try not to eat unhealthy things as sweets. So today I made a really healthy microwave brownie because, you know, sometimes you just need that sweetness, but you want it to be good for you. So I'm going to have the recipe that I used linked below because it seriously tastes so amazing. I just combined a bunch of healthy ingredients into a mug, microwaved it, and then you end up with this delicious brownie. Seriously, it tastes so amazing and you don't have to feel guilty about it. So you can satisfy your sweet tooth without feeling Feeling bad and yeah I just like to have a little dessert every single day and this is a healthier version so I really like to make that and then I just enjoyed my little 
mug brownie while I sat on the couch and watched some Gilmore Girls with my mom. We are seriously obsessed with Gilmore Girls, guys. Like, it's our favorite show ever. I'm only on season two right now, but we watch this together sometimes during the week, and it's just really fun to kind of hang out together, watch one of our favorite shows, and just relax after a long day at work and school. So let me know if you guys watch Gilmore Girls and what episode you're on if you do watch it. Oh, baby, I love your madness. After that, I like to take a shower. I've always been a night shower. I just wouldn't have time to get my hair dried in the morning, so I always take them at night. And some of the products that I use in the shower are the Pantene shampoo. It makes your hair super soft. This is not sponsored by the way. And then some Keratin Suave Conditioner, my Mario Badesco face wash, and some gingerbread latte body wash from Bath & Body Works. And yes, I am that person who brushes their teeth in the shower, but honestly, it's just so much more convenient and it kills two birds with one stone, if you know what I mean. So I love doing that. And after the shower, um, I'm looking a little ratch and I always have like my mascara under my eyes look like a raccoon so I take that off with my makeup remover and I will also put on my Clinique moisturizer around my nose and cheek area because that always gets super dry at nighttime and this just helps keep it moisturized and lastly I'll just take off the towel for my hair because that even looks more ratchet and I'll just brush out my hair and after that I set like 50 alarms because I'm the type of person who sleeps through it so I have to set a million of them to wake up on time and then I'll plug in my phone and go to bed. As you can see I tried to get Aisha to sleep with me tonight because I always try to do this every single night and usually she leaves in the middle of the night she just leaves me but tonight she's actually staying with me so it was really nice I just love petting her cuddling with her and that is it for my night routine. So that was it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. It seriously means the world when you guys subscribe and I can't believe it. We're almost at 200,000 which blows my mind. I'm so thankful for you guys and let's try to get to 200,000 is my goal right now so it would really mean a lot to me. Also please don't forget to check out minilucy.com for these mini lucy shirts in a bunch of different colors and comment down a slogan to see if you could have your saying on a shirt and let me know if you like this night routine. So I think that's all I have to say for this video. Thank you guys so much again for watching. I love you so much and I'll talk to you in my next video.